We're ready. Okay, so we now know how to use a calculator. Yay. And we now know how to add two numbers together. Yay. So we're going to use normal probabilities in a question. Okay. Do you know what Mensa is? You heard? <laughs> no, she's not a person. Yeah, it's like a club for really smart people to go to and do puzzles. Okay. Yeah. So it says the criteria, we're sticking with the same thing with IQ. The criteria, Sadia, okay, if you can't do this, come on. The criteria for joining Mensa is an IQ of at least 131, okay? Assuming that IQ has the distribution, X is normally distributed with a mean uh, of 100 and a standard deviation of 15 for a population, determine what percentage of people are eligible to join Mensa. So, the probability that a random person is eligible to join Mensa means that their IQ needs to be greater than 131. It is technically greater than or equal to 131, but we're just saying it's greater than 131. Okay, we're just, it doesn't matter. When we're doing normal distributions, it doesn't matter. We don't have to do any of that kind of trickery at all. So I want greater than 131. So I'm going to go back to my calculator. I'm going to turn it on. And I've still got my standard deviation is 15 and that my average is 100. And I wanted it to be the lower is 115. Wait, 131, sorry. And I want the upper to be whoosh, massive. And my probability is 0 0.0194, because I'm rounding, OK? 0 0.0194. 0 0.0194. Okay. Here comes the interesting part. If 30 adults are randomly chosen, the probability that at least find, sorry, this is now asking you to find, that if 30 adults are randomly chosen, find the probability that at least three of them will be eligible to join. So we've got 30 people. We've got a probability that someone will be eligible to join. The people are independent from each other. Their brains are independent of each other. It's a binomial distribution. OK? So it's binomial because there are fixed, I hate when the board does this, there's a fixed number of people. There's a fixed percentage to be able to join thingy. There's two outcomes. You can either join or you can't join. And they're independent from each other because, believe it or not, Sufian's brain is independent from anyone else's brain. OK? Anyone's brain is independent. So we can use we can use the binomial distribution. Just wait a second, Hamza, yeah? And our binomial distribution, we've got to now say something different, OK? Y is, uh, is if someone is eligible to join. So we, the, test, the test statistic is that someone can join. Y is the number of people who can join. Mensa. And we know that Y is distributed binomially, what goes in here? Three. No, 30 oh, and, then zero. and 0 0.0194. We want to know the probability that at least three of them. So I want to know the probability that y is greater than or equal to three, which our, my graphics calculator can do, but it's the same as one minus the probability that y is less than or equal to two. So it's going to be 1 minus, I'm going to do this the non-graphics calculator way, even though I could do it the graphics calculator way. So I'm just going to go now back out of this into my distribution and into binomial. I'm going to be doing cumulative because we're talking about less than or greater than, not exact. And I'm going to say that my lower was, I think it was between, I was doing 0 and 2, wasn't I, for this. And there are 30 people, and it was 0 0.0194. Yeah. So 0.0194. Nine seven nine nine nine. Which is zero point zero two zero one. So if I had a group of thirty people, there is a two percent chance that three of them 
or more would be able to join Mensa. Okay? So what I would like you to do, we're going to spend 11 minutes doing a couple of questions from exercise 3B, which is in the separate ones you've got now. Um, you can just do a couple of those questions. Spoiler, they are all normal, and then they become binomial. Okay? But I want you to ask yourself, why has it become binomial? Not just to, because I've told you it's become binomial. Why has it become binomial? Okay? So have you done a mental um, I can't say whether I'm in or not, it's private. No, I'm joking. I'm joking, I'm definitely not. <laughs>